Hey guys, Mystic here. Today guys, we're playing some Cities Skylines. Now, I've played this game quite a bit in the past, however, I've never gotten around to recording it, so we're gonna do that today. See how it goes. Make sure our settings are set properly. Music's fine. Yeah, sounds about right. Uh, let's just click New Game, see what we have. I can choose a scenario where we can change something, but that's not as much fun. Floodland. What's this? Play 240 games a week. Yeah, no thanks. Alright, so let's just choose from one of the many, many cities we have here. So we have Grand River, Foggy Hills, Cliffside, Rico Hills, Seven Lakes. I really do enjoy... I have all the DLC for this, by the way. I've had it for quite a while. Cop Creek's really nice. I don't want snow. Snow's really annoying. So it starts us off with a nice left and right road going into the city, and apparently a road that appears as we zoom into it. With the next thing just to do is build a nice little roundabout just at the end and we'll take the streets and remove the edges like that perfect and now everyone is in progress to getting in and out of the city without fail hopefully now if this goes wrong it's not my fault i'm going to blame it on the people who build the city i mean the people who live in the city yeah that's the one all right so first we're going to start with an, a residential zone so i kind of like how it looks here so i'm just gonna start like that uh, I can't really make a curve, can I? Okay. So we don't want to go too far into the forest here, but I guess we're going to have to slightly. Let's just build every pathway like that. And this will be our rare residence to live, just in a little suburb off the town. Not too bad, not, nothing too big. And they can just line up like that. Look at that. I'm like a city expert. And then we're just going to zone this off into residential uh, plot land like this. Perfect, and then we'll just go here and touch this up so we don't have people with unwanted territory and land. Perfect. Actually, you know what? I'm going to clear that. Like that. Make a really nice looking city. Yeah, that sounds... Uh, you know what? We'll zone this to be like that and that. There we go. So there's our uh, residential zone. Now we need some commercial. Not too much commercial to start the game off, so it's not too big of a deal. But we will... Uh, I think going a bit further is fine. Yeah. And then we'll just have it line up with this road. I want a 180 degree angle. Oh wait, no I don't. There we go. And then we're just gonna line, basically do the exact same thing. Now these aren't the same plot points as the last one. But it kind of, it's not maximizing efficiency at that point, but it's fine. We don't really care too much about maximizing efficiency right off the bat. And we're just gonna zone this part for commercial. And then we're gonna zone this part for industrial. Leave this non-affected for now, and we'll see. Actually, you know what? Let's zone you for commercial, and we'll fix that little plot right there in a second. And the only reason I'm not... Mm, you know what? We'll just... We don't need this much commercial right away, so you know what? I'll leave it. I mean, sorry, industrial. You know, that should be fine to start off. Now, let's just get some wind and power going on here. The only thing good about here is the fact that we can do very easy power lines down the mountain just running down to the town and then right across here should theoretically power the entire town and that's why i didn't want to do the anything otherwise like that Ah, right, where's my water at i right, water's in city bounds thank goodness i right, streams flowing that way so we're going to pull from downstream and then dump at the very end of the stream right across like that and then one pipe coming up like this actually we're gonna do a pipe directly down the middle put a water tower in the middle of the thing perfect and then we'll connect that pipe straight to this line and then that can go straight up like this well that doesn't cover the entire town that's so sad okay let's start our town see how the people roll in see what happens are there going to be snow-themed buildings? Oh, they are. Surprisingly, I, I honestly don't know how I've never played in a snow village before, but I haven't. I've never seen snow-themed towns or anything like that since, so it's actually really cool to see all this being built. Damn, that's a pretty big house. Oh, we don't have power. I see the problem here. And there we go. Look at that. The entire town is powered, watered, and ready to go. Oh, it's nice time already. Oh, look how nice it looks. It's so calming and relaxing. Nice little town going on here. Let's see who we have. Is anyone left on the streets? Ooh, hello. Oh, wait, where'd you go? You disappear from me. What's this place called? Fault Tech. Okay. Oh, there's more than one Fault Tech. Fault Tech's taking over our town already. Ah, uh, nice burger joint right here. What else do we have? Some unicorn banners. Sally's. So I'm assuming that's like a diner of some sort. What else do we have? Fault Tech's pretty much taking over the entire 
town already with all their con construction and companies. Hey, let's see what we can do. What's going on? Medium demand for industry or offices. Interesting. Okay, you know what? We'll expand our industry right away then. What we'll do is we'll wrap around and do a whole court of industry this way. Yeah, that shouldn't be too bad. It's not too much. It's not like an insane amount. And we'll just square off this entire industry for the middle part. And then we'll give an industry on the back line. And that takes care of the whole town. Perfect. Now, medical bay is very important. Just along the lines over here, we're gonna have everything medical and oh, school we gotta wait on money for. But no, we have quite a good growth in town so far. We, we're losing electricity, so we're just gonna put another windmill up top. We don't have enough for a windmill. Good to know, we're building too many things at a time. We could go take out a loan or we could wait. How much is it, six grand? Yeah, All right, we're gonna wait. We're currently losing money per week, which isn't good. Let's see if it, we make that money back. Nope, we're in an infinite loss at this point. Good to know. Okay, we're gonna take out, uh, we're gonna raise taxes. 10% is usually safe to start with. That should bring our money back up to a positive. Yeah, there we go. Cool, we're not losing as much money anymore. And we're making profit. Get power going. All right, that should suffice our power needs. Now we just gotta pay that back right away. And we're in the hole again. All right, let's slow it down a bit and let's take our nice time. See what everyone's up to. How's this going down here? Go nuts, don't nuts. Interesting. Sedan. Oh, Earl Grey. Where's Earl Grey? We're gonna see where Earl Grey lives. The Hemlock Residence. Wow, Earl. You're doing really good for yourself over here. Oh, Earl just bought some donuts and went home. Oh, these don't have water. Shoot. What's your problem? Not enough workers. Okay. You know, we'll get more city in here. And we're still losing power, somehow. How do we not have enough power still to this point? I feel like three windmills at max capacity should be plenty of enough but i guess not so we'll add another one mm, i see the problem i didn't connect it you know that makes a lot more sense ah there we go power power issue is solved now we need more residential zoning oh you know what i just realized there's no way to connect you know it's fine we'll do trails can we do trails yet mm, what's this this is a snow dump there we go. The road should be clean of snow now. I don't think I can do pathways yet, can I? It doesn't look like it. Two lane roads with grass. I just want to do pathways. I think that's some landscaping. I can't do that just yet. Yes, I know you need power. My bad. Oh, worthy village. Now we have new area. Cool. Because we're going to be soon running out of space this raid. And somehow we're still low on energy. So I think we're just going to need to put a coal plant down. I didn't want one yet, but I think we need it. Man, like all that pollution immediately. Oh, it's so sad, but it's the best we can do. Something I do realize is that they have to make an entire loop to get between the industrial and so that does take extra time. Oh, the hemlock. Is it Greg? Is Greg in trouble? Wait, is everyone just called hemlocks? Okay, see, I'm confused. This is the hemlock residence. That's also the hemlock residence. Okay, you know. I felt very, uh, I was very confused for, concerned for Greg, but I'm no longer very concerned for Greg. I think he's safe. I think he's safe where he is. Education, we'll figure out once we get some money. Let's take out another loan. Let's start building. Just in case we do have a fire, we should put it over in this section. Police department, same. Same situation right across from the fire department. An elementary school could fit in right here. There we go. Satisfy the entire neighborhood. Yes, I get your water situation. I'll fix you up. There we go. Happy. Everyone's supplied with power, availability, consumption, much better. All right, that coal power plant's helping a lot, I guess. Commercial zoning, interesting. I didn't think we need much more commercial just yet. So we'll just zone this entire section off to commercial and let them build in between where they want. We don't want too much clutter and uh, construction and shopping, people parking on the side in the middle here. So we just want to keep that clear of space to say the least. Water availability, sewage treatment, we're doing fine here. All right, let's just zoom in through the night. Let's see where sewage is doing. It doesn't look too bad. The water is not freezing over, which is a good sign. It hasn't snowed yet, so the snow plows aren't going out. Landfill, garbage processing status. It's low. Well, that's not good. Oh no, it's low amount of landfill usage. So that's good to know. New building. What did we get? Uh, an elementary school. Okay, let's see what else we can do. Oh, it's snowing. Okay, let's see how are the garbage the snow plows work. Let's slow it down a bit. Wow, the snow looks so good. When you're not moving. If you're not moving, it looks fine. But when you're moving, it stops moving with you. All right, let's just have a flurry come out. See what happens here. Let the snow just fall. I just want to see the snow pile up on the roads. I don't, I don't, I think having snow plows prevents it completely from what I understand here. And we're, oh no, it's a thunder snowstorm. So I think I need another residential zone. How am I going to do this? I didn't plan for the city very well. I don't want to destroy Greg's house. That's very rude. I can't destroy Greg's house. I can't do him like that. I'm gonna connect them back here. I'll connect them between each road, actually. 
and then I need to rebuild the power lines immediately before everyone loses power and starts freaking out. Oh, well, that's fine. Your house can be destroyed. All right, so we need a lot more residential zoning. Uh, new building. Landfill. What did I get? No, I already have that. That's fine. Okay, I think we're going to make another zone down here, like a little suburb. No, that's... I don't want it too close to the highway, so... This is like one little town. Well, look at it like this. This is one little sector, right? Eh, you know what? This town can expand still. I don't know this person, right? Let's just destroy both their houses. You know, it's not that big of a deal. It could have been worse. We don't want them going too close to the highway, just in case they do have children. Oh, okay, so that's what the snow looks like on the roads. Good to know, good to know. Alright, we're gonna have residents potential right on the highway. I'm just gonna make sure that's connected to the water pipes. Straight down to the sewers. Just how I like it. I think everything looks... Oh, shit, we got a new town. Cool. I think everything looks nice and connected. All fine and dandy. If they complain about power loss, that's not my fault anymore. I've given them plenty of enough power to deal with. Oh no, these are being abandoned. Oh, I need to knock them down now. Alright, bye. A new place will just replace them, so it's not a big deal. They're gonna, look, they're immediately being rebuilt. Alright, so this is their first town. Let's build another town. So, if everyone comes off of here, I don't want traffic to be that big of a deal. Like, I don't want it to be distracting, you know what I mean? Not much flavor and care to this side of the build, but... Oh, I don't have enough money, so we better start zoning fast. And like that, you know, it's not looking too bad. And then we'll make sure to get a landfill out here just... Be oh no, we're sacking money again. And I just realized I don't have enough money to build. Uh oh, we still need to pay our loans off. You know what, we're just gonna increase taxes to 11. We're gonna cut landfill costs, um, hospital bills, it's fine. Monuments, we're not paying anything. Police station, no one really needs the police, do they? Right, fire department down, schools, cut the school budget. Now, how much money are we losing per week? Not bad, we're making money, I think, right? Are we gonna make money at all today? Nice, we're no longer hemorrhaging. Now see, that's now a sign of success. We're not hemorrhaging money anymore. Now see, they have a problem over here. They don't have power or electricity or water. So maybe I shouldn't have connected this town because this is really bad. You can now build canals, that's fine. I don't want canals. Ah, here we go. Here's the pathways we wanted earlier. We better start making money fast. And I mean, actually fast. Yeah, I think we expanded too large without having the budget to do that, which was a really bad idea now that I think about it. It'd be a lot more efficient with our piping. Come on, make some money. 2200 a week. That's pretty good. Oh no, we're losing. We're losing money again. Electricity quick. Okay, like that. There we are. Everyone should have power now? See, there's no problems here in our town. Oh no, there is problem still. Perfect. Now everyone has... Nope. I, I lied. Not everyone has electricity and water. Come on. Give me some money. There we go. Okay, now everyone has power, electricity. Everyone should be fine. If anyone complains, I'm going to be angry. Why are you complaining about we're not producing enough energy? That's a shame. It's a real big shame. Eight milliwatts. How much would one of these produce? We're not even close to enough money on that. Okay, you know what? We can't even hemorrhage our losses because that won't even come close to how much power we need. Sewage? Really? Oh no, our entire town's collapsing. Oh, it's because there's no water. Right. You know, that makes sense. No power, no water. Hmm. I you know, now we're losing money. So I think the best way to solve this is just to remove power from this side of the town. Let these all clear out. See, all their sewage is fixed. Let them make us money. They will make us money for sure. They might all leave. But as long as this number goes up, that's all we need. And until this number goes up to 19,000, then we can replace the city. We all have to clear the abandoned buildings. Yes, we will. Like so. We'll just clear these out. And there we go. There's the money we needed. That's all I needed to do. Now, we'll build a power plant. Where was the industrial zone on this side? Everyone should be fine for power. There we go. Much better. Now look at us. Public library. People are so needy in this town, but I think a public library would do fine just here. There we go. Make everyone happy. Emergency services, we need them, I guess. But we don't want to hemorrhage too much cost on everything. But it's looking fine. Like, I don't see any issues. That's an abandoned building. We'll just clear it out. Other than that, everything's looking to go fine. It's nighttime, everyone's going on. Pollution's not too bad, that coal plant. Kinda sucks that we have a coal plant right on the main stretch of the road, but I think it should be fine. We're gonna end off with two giant flaming buildings.